Welcome along everyone to round 2 of the AOR iRacing uh, Formula Renault 2.0 Championship um, Last time out we had an alright start to the race at Spa but um, we had contact with the, the race leader uh, at the time uh, or he had made his stop and he was the race leader coming into the pits um, <clears throat> but today we are at a uh, Zandvoort track which I've never raced at um, do know the circuit but um, I've never raced at it so this will be my first go at this and I've qualified in 20th um, but as you can see the grid is so close um, so um, it's time to to grid up and start the race Okay then. Most important to um, be nice and clean and to turn one. Lots of cars going slow. It is so hectic here right now. Okay, I think we're clear now. Let's go for it. I think that's Fizzy out the race. Don't know what happened to him. But I'm happy to get through turn one without any ins. Eh, the first little bit there. Oh, we've got some action up ahead. On there's Evan. Ah. Oh. Well, it uh, looks like we're going to be back at the grid now. <sighs> Don't really want to go. I think we'll go now. And I'm at the back. Which was great. I just, <laughs> just when I seen Evan spin there, just to like, um, my own spin myself. Here we go, back up to the 
back of this pack again who are scrapping out and I think that's why they're losing time. There's a car spun. I'm not going to try and overtake here. Okay, so we moved up a couple of positions there on that lap. Miss the apex. Oh dear, that's a big crash. So kicking off in this lap. I think we're actually catching the next sort of group of cars here, so it's probably wise. It's probably wise to stick behind Lino. Made a mistake there. That's that pressure I was talking about. So that's released us. And hopefully we can catch the group ahead. Oh, that was a close one. I just think he's this car again is sort of holding me up. Well, I'm just Pattern. It's time to get the head down again and catch the next group of cars. Okay, so next time around will be our pit stop.
So I think that went quite well. Um, and I've came back out in the same sort of position as when the other, all these other cars in front of me pitted. So I'd say that was a success. Initially, I was going far too far fast entering the um, pit lane. I had to slow the car right down to avoid getting a, a stop and go penalty. Oh dear, that's Leicester. That really is the problem when you sort of run wide like that. It just um, it just pulls you in and it doesn't it doesn't end well. <laughs> but I hope for his sake that he managed to get out, which I think he did. Next up the road for me is my fellow Scotsman, it's Evan, it's only 2.3 seconds. Why didn't I just shift into third gear? Why was I so reluctant? Really spun there. Not a good lap from me. Lost some more time to Evan. Don't think I'm going to catch him. As much as I'm trying to catch Evan and have a little battle with him, um, I also need to remember I would like to finish the race. We've got eight more laps to go, or seven more laps to go. We're nearly there. After a bad start, when we spun halfway around the track, I think um, we've made a quite a good recovery. Happy with the race anyway. Um,
Oh, that's too much carp. Evan's pushing hard as well to try and catch uh, Nigel. Nigel Spears ahead of him. I think actually they maybe going side by side. No, they're going for it now. We're on the last lap. Let's make it a good one. Evan is still behind Nigel. And they're going, I thought they were going to go side by side through there. And I'm trying to get as close as I can to take advantage of any um, issues they have. Running wide slightly into the fast right hander. Nigel's done a, a great job of defending against Evan. Evan's now side by side with them. What's going to happen here? Nigel's spun. Just exactly what I said. I'm right in the, the good spot just to... Take advantage of any problems they have, and we come round the last corner. We've completed the, our first race. Well, it's the second race of the, the championship, but... We didn't finish the first one, but we finished the second. Oh, I'm so glad. So let's have a look at the results anyway. So it was Godin that won. Congratulations to him. Phil Reed in second. And uh, to Cash in third. And um, we finished in 13th. Um, yeah. I'd say that's not bad, especially after we spun. And the first lap, I think it was. No, it was the third lap. Um, uh, third lap. Let's just get to it, which is just up here. So Evan starts to have a spin, and straight away. I just do the exact same thing. And then I've got to wait until the last car. And that's not the last car, but the next one's the last car. But So, we, at, at that point, we were in last place. Then we make up one position. I don't know if he's let me buy. So eventually get by, and then it's head down from there and pump in some times and try and catch the group ahead, which we did eventually, um, which was pretty satisfying. And um, then we had a great battle with um, Lino Alberto. Um, not quite sure what lap that was, but we'll just um, have a look and see. Okay, here we go. And eventually just gave in to the pressure and made a slight mistake and we took advantage of that. Then we found ourselves up 
on the back of the uh, Lystern Evan. And what lap did we pit? Was it lap 23? Yep, lap 23 we pitted. Um, fast forward that a little bit. And we came out just behind Lystock. And it looks like we made maybe a second or so on him um, through the pit stops. Um, I can't remember actually, did we pass him? Did we do an overtake on him? Uh, or did he just... Oh, okay, yes, yeah, I remember. He ran wide at the last corner. And went into the gravel. And a problem there. As you can see. Then, that is Evan ahead, isn't it? Yep. And then, from there to the end of the race, it was trying to catch Evan pushing so hard... You can see there lap 30, done a 133.2, and I was in the 33s all the way up to lap 37, um, which just showed how hard I was pushing. Um, my fastest lap was a 32.7, which I think I done in qualifying, eh, not in practice, sorry, I done a 32.8, so there we go. Went faster than my practice time. So, all in all, not a bad race for me. Um, glad to make up the positions back after my spin. And hopefully we'll have a better race um, next week, round three. And we're at Phillip Island, I think that is, in Australia. So, another track that um, I haven't raced on iRacing, but I know the layout and I've raced in other games. So hopefully we'll have a good race there and um, yeah, until then, um, thank you all for watching and um, take care.